Hey y'all, it's Melissa. Welcome to Messy Missy Creates. We're going to make the October capsule. Um, I've been pulling stuff from every different direction. I need to do this before I can start actually journaling in my October journal because, you know, I want to be able to take a piece from every, for every day in my journal if I can. Um, I did decide, let's see, um, well, I was going to say one thing, but maybe two things. Um, I did decide that I'm going to use the stuff in the capsule or I'm not, maybe I should say I'm not going to limit myself to using the stuff in the capsule for just my journal, but also like some things if I make tags, um, you know, basically, I just want to use it up in the month. And so, if I use it in my journal, that's great. If I use it making tags, that's great. So, I may end up with a lot of items in this month's capsule. I want to try it that way and see how it works because I know I want to make more tags. I know I want to make more journaling spots. I've had some of this paper for, I mean, this is all the Halloween. Actually, that's not true. I found some after I showed you all that last time. But this Halloween paper is basically all that I have that is, you know, really Halloween. And I've had it for years. So anything that I might want to make a point to use in this month, I want in this basket because it's easier for me to find. I keep it on my desk and everything's at the ready. So I know that that 12 by 12 paper doesn't fit all the way in there, but I'm just going to line the bottom of the basket with this paper and I may cut a piece to use on a, on a tag. I may cut a piece to use in my journal. It doesn't matter how I use it. I just want to make sure I use it. So with that said, the second thing is not something I decided, just something I'm going to keep in mind as I'm adding things to the journal. Um, Allison's item of the month challenge for October is, well, if you haven't watched the video, go watch it real quick and come back. Um, but her item of the month it for October is ephemera. So I have been looking for things that I consider to be ephemera. Now, ephemera can be almost anything, y'all. I mean, it seriously can. We add ephemera to our journals every day. But then there's some things that I have that I really consider to be ephemera. For example, this little... Um, it was some cuticle cream I got, but it's packaging. So I, ideally I would have put it in my journal on the day that I got it. Um, I can't remember what day that was, so I didn't use it. Um, I want to go, this is almost going to second as a clean off the desk thing too, because I want to go through all my, I know I'm not going to be able to go through all my baskets in this video, but I would very much like to go through and pick out See, like, this one says, is it fall yet? This is an old printable from um, Pocket Journal Pam. And I know that I have a good bit of that stuff. So, I want to um, dig through some of these things. And this one says, I am thankful for. This is a printable from Illustrated Faith. Thankfulness is kind of related to fall in a way. Maybe more so November. Um but doesn't mean you can't be thankful in October, right? So, um, this is some old printables that I, or things, this is actually a piece of ephemera. It's a color transparency. Um, I may put that in there. Now, I reserve the right to go back through the, the capsule when we're done here and change my mind on some things. It just depends on how much stuff I have in here. This is a cute little quote. It's pink. I'm not going to use it. Whisk me away. Um, not sure. It's a possibility because let's see, am I going to make, I hope to have more zucchini this month. So then I would maybe bake some zucchini bread. I definitely would use it for October. I'm going to stick it in here for right now. So, this is, um, it's the little things that matter. That looks like, on the surface, it looks like a cup of coffee, but that looks like green, like split pea soup. <laughs> it's showing up green on my 
camera, I think. But um, a cup of coffee, not fall specific. These are some backgrounds that are collage that I printed on cardstock. They're not very fall-like, so um, this kind of reminds me of fall. I think this was a pocket journal Pam thing as well. Um, I don't think of too many butterflies in fall. Actually, yeah, I'll put one of them in there. Um, these are some little cards that I need to go through and we'll definitely have a clean off the basket, clean off the basket. <laughs> yeah, we're going to have a clean off the basket video. Um, take every chance in life you get, you get in life because some things only happen once. Here's some words I need to add to my, um, word basket. But right now all I'm doing is picking out the fall stuff. Um, some old numbers I printed off. Carrots, beets, cup of tea. Um... I'm old school. Instead of ranting on social media, I just scream in people's faces. You know, that's not entirely true, but I'm not one to rant on social media either. Um, maybe I'll put that in there. Nudge them back. That looks like ephemera. Anyway, I was trying to just pick out the fall. Dear me, don't be so hard on yourself. You're doing okay. Avoiding problems. Um, see like this one I'm going to put in here. It's an illustrated faith printable, but she's got a scarf and a sweater. I'm going to throw it in here for now, but I think I will probably use that more like in November or December because, well, sometimes those are iffy on whether they're sweater weather. Um, let's see. Hey, some days aren't worth putting on a bra, and the amen to that. Okay, so there's that. These numbers are actually fall related too. I think I'm gonna drop them in. Those are Brooks numbers, um, and these were her. I think these were hers as well. Brooke at Recreations by Brooke. These were pocket journal pams for probably September years ago. Um, let's see. Okay, there's one basket. This is not going to happen fast enough. I mean, I, I'm not going to have time to sit here and go through every basket on my desk. So, I'm just going to have to hit some of the high points. Um, here's a big football. I can put that in there. I need to glue it together. Okay, let's try this from a different perspective. Um, you know what? We'll come back and do a clean off the desk. I can always add stuff to my capsule. Well, now I got it going on here. Camp. Okay, so here's a campfire. I know that we're going camping later in the month, so I'm going to put that in there. See, this is why you go through your stuff, right? Yep, yep, yep. Snow. I don't need a snowflake. Oh, that was my Coda bear. That was my first grand dog. And that was my daughter when she was building her bus. These obviously belong on journal pages that I never did. Um, there. Oh, here's a pumpkin number. I'm gonna pull it out. I'm probably not gonna use those, but oh, that was my mom. Here's another football. Yeah, let's put that in there. Um, anything that I decide not to use, I will put back in. I will, like, forward it to November. I mean, like, if I end up with a bunch of footballs, then I won't, you know. Okay, I'm not going to sit here and go through the rest of this stuff. Um, this is going to take too long. But I do need to do this and clean off my desk. Um, actually, one of these I'll put in there. Because I have a whole pack of them, but that one keeps laying around. So, it's going in there. Um, put my mom back in the basket. These are my printable notepads. Or note, note pads, note something. Um, I could cut one of them. Um... 
and put in there. Of course, I could just put them in my printable basket. That I will do. Get them off my desk. Okay, so I'm going to put that one in there. Um, so here's the capsule so far, and I may have to weed some stuff out. Now, here are my big baskets. Um, and this is kind of what I did last time. I just went through some stuff. Now, these are these ended up being excess baskets that, I mean, just things that didn't... If there's an empty basket, it's going to get stuff in it. That's just all there is to it. Oh, here's my footballs. So I'll put those in there. See, how did they end up in here? I don't know. This is probably good paper for fall, but it doesn't. it's not specific to fall. Okay, so let me put that basket somewhere else. Okay, this is what I consider to be ephemera. Now, you saw me. I was going to use these in August. I think I used one or two. I was going to continue to use them in September. But these, to me, are also fall colors. So, let's pick a couple of things out. Now, I see a camera right off the bat. I think I already used one. Um... Let's pull a couple of things because I know that I'm going to be putting a lot of pictures in my journal this month. Um, stay motivated. I love the skate. That one's cute. Oh, that one's super cute. Um, oh, I'll put the happy face in. See, I think these are all fall colors too. Be the best version of you. Shine bright. I don't... I'm going to end up sitting here putting everything in here. Okay, don't do that. Just put a couple things in here. Um, love, love, love. These are just cute little... I might use some of these on tags, too. Put that little flower in there. No bad days. Okay, I'll use one of these because where we're going has mountains. Well, not big mountains, but I live in Florida. We're flat. So, to me, they're mountains. I mean, they're still mountains. They count, but, you know. Um, maybe if I get a good sunrise picture, which I'm sure I will. Put that one in there. Okay, I might need to stop looking because I'm going to have 85,000 things in my, in my, whatchamacallit? Whatchamacallit? Um, okay, here's like sun on the water. So I'll do that. Now let me see if I can get all these back in this bag. That's the neat trick. Rain or shine. So again, if I use them on tags, I will pull them from my capsule. So that's what I'm saying. I'm not limiting myself to just my journal. My goal is just to use certain things. I mean, I can still use things that are not, not in the capsule. You saw me do that in September. Um, if I didn't say it already, I meant to say it initially. Um, the capsule is inspired by Lydia at February and June. Um, she does a monthly capsule. And so that's where I got, that's where I saw it first. Here's some random magazine images. I think I've already peeked through these. I don't think there's, I mean, I can always use Thunder and Lightning. These are pages that I've already cut up, maybe, and haven't used. Okay, I probably could use that. I'll put that in there. Celery, I did plant celery this month. No, actually, I planted. I will be planting celery. So, maybe I'll put that in there, but I always think of using this when I harvest celery. But, let's see... Again, I mean, if I come back and use these, these are just images I need to cut up and put in my images file. Okay, so I need to empty those two baskets. Okay, here are my pockets, tucks, and tags. Here's two tags that I already pulled out of here. Definitely want to use the Halloween one this month. Um, definitely want to use this one. Even though I could use this one in November, I think I definitely want to use... I think I definitely... How's that for... Yeah, okay. So I think, oh, see, here's a tag. See, I would have forgotten about that tag being in here. 
This is one I made a while back. Um, I can add some ribbon or ruffle or something to it. Won't be harvesting broccoli. I will be planting broccoli. I mean, I've already started the seeds. But I know that I made some fall tags on that first video. I made when I made these. Actually, I don't even think I made these on video. These are Lydia's garden printables. They're in her Etsy shop. Um, again, doesn't mean that I can't come back and get it. There's just certain things that I want to make sure to use. And if they're in this capsule, it, the capsule has been a great place for me to keep things that I definitely want to use. And right now it's the fall related. Now these actually shouldn't be in here really. They should be in my little box. Now that I have a little box, I uh, might do this one. Enjoy the little thing. Wait, no, I'm gonna use this one. Together is my favorite place to be. That's going in the capsule. And um, I'm just looking to see if I had another fall related one in here. Put those in my little bit box. It's not a bit box. It's my journaling card box. Allison calls hers a bit box, and I keep saying bit box. That might be a fun pocket to use this month. Kind of vintage, which reminds me of fall colors. I have two of them, so um, I'm gonna, I think I'm going to use that one. And these are fun. These little frames. Oh, look at the yellow and purple. I'll put that in there. Well, here's a single purple one. Um, I don't want them all in there. Weekend vibes. This was a, and there's a birthday pocket. And then I have random packaging down here that shouldn't be in here, but it is. Okay. Okay. Everybody go back in. I don't know whether to... It would be nice if I had a picture that would fit right in there. The yellow and purple, the purple I'm only going to use on Halloween. So I can either take this one or I can cut. And I'm not going to put five of them in there because I doubt I will use it. Well, I'm going to put them in there. If I don't use it, I can cut it later. Okay. How's that for deferring a decision? Okay, this is just my basket with some backgrounds in it. Um, this one I printed, it was, it. somebody else did this one. Um, maybe Melanie Sullivan, I can't remember. This actually looks like Christ, a little bit of Christmas. So maybe I will wait on this one. I was gonna put it in because of the oranges and golds, but I, I just saw the Christmas pattern in there. These are some backgrounds that I made. I drew this one. Of trash and then yeah I printed off I haven't used them yet but so I won't take anything out of that one I'll save that for Christmas nature and garden I know there's lots of bunnies in here there's lots of stuff that Allison gave me carrots I'm gonna wait um, I usually harvest carrots in like no I don't know maybe January January, February, March, somewhere in there. So I have book pages. I've already looked through those. I've already looked through that basket. Let's see if we can use some of these again. Okay, maybe this yellow with orange. That one might be easier to use. And then I think I want to use another one of these frames because I know that when we go on a trip, I'm going to have several um is that a white one okay good um i know i'm gonna have several pictures that i want to use now come the end of the month when i'm trying to use all this stuff remind me that i said 
Shoot. Do you think I thought to bring my scissors in here? No, I did not. Oh, here's my big pair. I want to use one of these. This is a... I think it's a Diane uh, Reevely uh, Delusions border. This is my die cuts and borders basket. I want it. I think I want to use that one this month. Okay, so that's enough out of that one. Scrap paper pattern. I don't think there's any fall or Halloween paper in here, but there could be. Um, these are not. Yeah, it is. Okay. It's clean. Um, no, I think there's Easter in here, but there's not. That's cute, though. That'd make a really cute tag. Maybe I will remember it's in here. I don't want to pull that and put it in the capsule, though. When I... Yeah, 4th of July, Easter. I think I started this one around Easter, or in the springtime. And junk mail. Um, there's not, there should be more in here, but there's not. Okay, so that's all my big baskets. Let's see, how are we doing on time? Yeek. So this is my fall, what I keep my fall stuff in. I've already pulled some stuff out. Let's see, I'm going to try not to hit you. Um, oh, it smells so good because there's one of these little cinnamon brooms in here. So when I open it, it makes me think of fall or cool weather or something. So I have some, um, this is like a random printout. This is from Illustrated Faith. I think it's just a cute little pumpkin. So I'm going to put that in there. These are some stickers I got last fall. I got them, I'm pretty sure at Hobby Lobby. And I don't know, I didn't end up using them last year, I don't think. Um, I'm going to put one in here, but I'm tempted to put two because I have so many. So let's do that. What's this? Rest for your soul. I don't know why that, that's not specifically a fall thing. Um, here's a little fall. I stamped a bunch of leaves. So it's like a good little leaf border. I did it sort of in a, not ombre, but yeah, you know what I'm trying to say. That's not specifically fall, but it is ephemera. This is ephemera. I'm gonna set it over here for now. This is just a scrap piece of the papers that I use for my journal. I'm gonna put that in there. I don't know what I would, maybe a tab or something like that. This is not specifically fall. So I'm gonna get that out of here. This one I'd like to cut up. I'm not gonna sit here and take your time and cut it up. So I'm gonna put it in my capsule and I'm going to pull out the ones that pertain to fall like this has fall leaves this has a pumpkin it says thanks um so i'll pull this and then put it um i'm gonna pull this this was some pumpkins that i drew now i drew that when i first printed them they were darker than i wanted them so i um printed i did them in another color so um, this was when I was drawing those pumpkin numbers. And so I'm going to put this in the capsule. I'm going to use it. This was when I was playing around with leaf numbers and they're partially cut out. This and this is thankful paper. So I'm going to save that for November. I don't know that I'm going to use these leaves. Um, this paper I will use this month. I would imagine that paper I can save that one. I can save. This one maybe for this month. This one definitely for this month or not. You know what I mean? Those are not fall. Um, I don't use napkins a lot in my journal and these are not open, but if I'm not going to, I mean, if they're not open, I can't use them. So if I open them and I put one in my capsule, then maybe I will use it. But I really, this is not where I keep my napkins. So, let's see, where did my scissors go again? Did I lose them already? I lost them already. But I put them down in my capsule. Why did you do that? I 
did not open them on the right side, on the correct side. It would have been easier to pull them out if they were opened on that, that side, the folded side. They're very pretty though. Look at them. Um, maybe I'll pull two. Maybe I will share them. Here's more of those stickers. I'm not sure what I did. Oh yeah, I see them. Here's some fall stickers that I need to use. I went to Hobby Lobby yesterday and I'm glad I didn't get more stickers. I almost got some fall stickers and I didn't um, because I got these either last year or the year before. Um, so these little pumpkins, bats and ghosts, these little felt stickers, I'll put in my capsule. Um, that's just white paper. I don't know why that's in there. That is technically not, yeah. So some of this I need to take out of here. That I can use. Um, oh, here's a piece of, here's a piece. Some brown and white. It's kind of a, yeah, it's brown and white striped. It almost has a, like a burgundy hint to it. Um, here's some tabs. I could put that in there. It's just a white tab. I think what I did is, oh, here's Happy October. I definitely need to use that in October. Thankful. Um, some of this come, oh, here's another campfire. Maybe I'll put that in there too. Thanksgiving. This says gratitude. That's got pie with a pumpkin. That's a napkin. Why did that end up in there? Um, anyway, I may have to sit down and go through this some more, but sweater weather, maybe this month. Here's a cute little green pumpkin. Happy. That shouldn't be in here. I mean, not that fall isn't happy, but I, I think it was part of happy birthday wrapping paper. Um, here's a, yeah. Looks like I just dumped stuff in here, to be honest with you. New traditions. Um, hello, my name is Thankful. Maybe use that next month. Um, what I keep starting to say, and I don't get it out of my mouth, because I get distracted is, um, there was a, oh, here's a leaf stamp. Um, there was an illustrated faith printable that I printed out and cut up some of it. And I think it was fall related. So I dumped it all in here. Stroll slowly. It's got a lantern. I know that when we go camping, I will take walks. Here's some pretty fall leaves. Maybe I will take some of those. Um, or I can save all of this for November. However, I know that where we're going has the change of leaves. We don't have them. Oh, that shouldn't have been in here. Okay. All right, I think I'm done with that. Here's a little label. It's in that turquoise color. This is um, a pretty tag. Sure, okay, like I said, I'm gonna end up with 3,000 things in this capsule. And, and even though I said some of this doesn't belong in here, I'm gonna have to dump this out and go through it because it's not all fall related as you very well saw. Um, but that's how I keep my um, fall stuff, or I have one for fall, one for like summer or 4th of July, and I have one for spring and Easter. Um, capsule's getting very full. Now I want to go through Happy Mail. Um, Hope had sent me, um, some beautiful Happy, some fall items in Happy Mail, and you've probably all seen this if you haven't, um, you know, you can go back and look. Um, I made a video of it. I think all, um, I'm definitely gonna put this one in here. I love that. This one I was gonna make a magnet out of. I haven't gotten my magnetic board yet back from my friend. 
I'm really inclined to put all of this in there, but I have it sitting next to me. I'll do that one. That's a good journaling spot. Um, I have it sitting right next to me, so I can use it, you know, out of the bag it's in. I don't have to, um, let's see, this one looks more Thanksgiving. I'll put that one in there just to make sure that I use them. And mercy. Um, maybe I just need to put the whole bag in the capsule. I definitely want, she gave me these pretty little envelopes with these cards. I'm going to put the orange one in there. The green and the yellow I technically could use in the springtime. So let me see what I do with the other ones first. And um, I am going to save some of this for November. However, I probably could have put more of it in my capsule. But I think the rest of it I'm going to use just out of the... I'm going to put the ribbons in the capsule. And this ribbon right here I'm going to put in the capsule too. Um, the rest of it I'm just going to use out of this bag. Because I've, I've been keeping the bag right here to my left. So I might just like set the bag in the capsule. And then I know that I can pull from it. Because obviously I don't have to use all of this for October. I can use some of it for November. And I mean if, you know, I may not be able to use all of it. Um, this month, but, um, see here's some fall washi. I'm going to put this in this bag. Um, she also gave me this fall washi. Um, I really need to just put the washi down in my washi bag, but I'm not quite ready to separate it yet. Okay. So, um, let me check another Happy Meal spot. This was a Happy Meal from Allison. Um, this looks like you, I'll wait to see if I get a map from the campground that we're going to. Um, if not, I probably could use that for a background for one of my days. I just would cover up the, you know, where it is. I'm task. Just seeing, I don't think there's anything fall specific. Oh, but look at the chickens. Yes, please. And there's bunnies in here. Oh, hello world. Cute. Um, I kind of some of the happy mail because I know that one of Allison's prompts for the challenge is happy mail. So, I was kind of waiting until then to use some of it. Um, I'm thinking. Yeah, maybe I'll wait to use that. I can always pull it out and use it. But I was kind of waiting. It's not, I was just making sure there wasn't anything fall specific in there. And I have plenty of stickers I can go through. Um, but I want to go through another type of stuff that I have. Okay, this is also what I consider to be ephemera. Okay, Tim Holtz gets two drawers in my, my little caboodle up there, whatever you want to call it. Um, this to me is always ephemera, maybe because he calls it ephemera. I don't necessarily want the tissue paper. I typically would use that in... Um, like art journal or collage or whatever. But I was thinking since this month's um, challenge item, item of the month challenge, is ephemera, that this might be a good time to use some of this. Boy, I made a mess out of this box, didn't I? Um, I also, he does a lot of, Tim Holtz does a lot of, um, a lot of vintage looking. I mean, well, it's almost all vintage looking. So to me, that fits with fall a little bit. Um, for example, I could use that one. Life doesn't have to be perfect to be wonderful. 
um, this one kind of, it's red, but it looks like a reddish orange. And I said I was going to put more journaling spots in my capsule this month. So, like, this is a great little journaling spot. Um, document the everyday. See? That's perfect for the capsule. Perfect for journaling. Remember the, the now. I'm going to put that in there, too. I just want to use everything. Everything, everything, everything. Okay, let me find some that are different days. I mean, I'm sorry, different sizes. Like this is bigger ones. These are good tags. Um, that one would be good. Who, what, where. I'm just looking for right now. Documented. This one it looks good in fallish. That one looks good in springish. On the back important details here and now that's that same one the story begins and I got this one in the smaller one um I think I'm gonna use this one I still have flowers in October um I could technically use another big one or I can use a smaller one let's see these are really small that would make a perfect little journaling spot. I have had these for so long and I, I very seldom ever use them. So they just sit in here. I don't know that I'm gonna attempt to put them back in the box right this second. But I also have wallpaper and then I have, this is what I was aimed at or trying to get. So if you saw me get with my Joann's haul, you saw me get some of Tim Holtz, or yeah, Tim Holtz, um, the little pockets with the file folder, in, like tags and pockets. And um, I couldn't get the tags in the pockets. So I've got to still cut them down. I might put one or two of them in the basket, in the capsule. But these are his file folders. And that one's kind of blue and green. I thought I might put one. These might be fun to use. They're very thick, so I don't use them in my journal often. But, uh, I may try. I don't know when else to use them. Um, thought about using some of this, but maybe one piece. We need to use our stuff, right? Um... I also have more white backgrounds in this journal. Um, this is black and white. I'll use that and I'll put this in there. Okay. I can't sew. I don't have the ability to sew in my journal right now. So adding some little sewn pieces would be good. And then here's some of the wallpaper. I typically only use this. And collage. Um, it's got the little flowers to go with it. I don't know if I want to use this in my journal. It's got white background. I could. You, it's kind of slick though. You hear it? I mean, it's got it's textured like wallpaper. Yeah, I may not add that. I can always come back and use it, or you know, dig it out of here. But that's the whole purpose of capsule, or that's my purpose of the capsule is because I forget. When I'm journaling, I forget to look at all my stuff. Okay, here's one other category. This was part of that big haul video that I did that, I'm trying to pull one more thing. Um, my friend gave me, and though this is more like collage paper, I thought, you know, it's kind of colored like fall. How about this one? So I thought that might be fun to have in the capsule, right? I'll take one of those. I can always come back and get more. Actually, I'm going to take two of these. I like this envelope. I think. I don't know. I don't know. Maybe I'd rather have that one. Well, I've already torn them out now. I'm not putting them back in. Okay. So, I'm just trying to grab bits from everywhere, right? Okay, these are little journaling tags. This came in that set, too. I'm also going to dig through the box later. Uh, I'm not going to do that with you on camera. Look, this one's perfect for fall. 
See the orange? Perfect. Great little journaling spot. And they've been sitting right here. And I, I pick them up almost every day. And I see them every time I journal, but I just haven't used them yet. So, what other kind of things do I... Oh, yeah, oh, yeah, 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 yeah. So, on the Tim Holtz thing, I have this. I know there's a glare on it, and I can't stop that, but... Let's see if I can do this without... This is Tim Holtz. Um, I believe it's almost all Tim Holtz. Um, oh, I had one other thing that I wanted to use. This was um, Souvenir Views um, because I figure I'll have a photo from my trip and it's a frame. And it's just been sitting in this, this was a third drawer. I don't know where, this is more hardware. So I'm not sure why this is in, and I'm not sure where the rest of it went. So um, maybe it's in here. So I, I definitely put this in the capsule. Let's see, I gotta hurry up. I don't know. I'm just gonna open a couple of these. This isn't my style necessarily for my journal. This is more like, I think of more like junk journal, kind of that vintagey feel, you know. So, although this one's kind of cute because it's like a journal. Um, like a planner or a journal or something like that. I don't know. I thought this was going to be a better idea than... Here, this one I might would use in my... That's just a tag. I could put it in my journal. Okay. So, I took something from out of here. I don't think I want to sit here and go through all of this. I thought I would just pull out kind of the highlights or the a couple of the boxes. Like, this one is milk caps. I'm not putting that in my journal. I'm honestly not sure what I would do with them. Now, this one is lots of little labels and stuff. Um, I got some of the... I have stickers that have that on there. Um, I got some of his ephemera packets, and I sat down one day, and I separated them out according to colors. Um, that one might be okay. It's red, though. I think of that more in December. Um, here's some green. see what we have here. Green and blues, maybe? That looks more blue. Daisy photo. That's so cute. It's so little, though. Blue, 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 green. If there was a larger frame in here, I would definitely use it. Um, we're going to a... Um, where we're going, there, there's going to be a craft fair, like a Halloween, no, 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 like a harvest festival. Oh, I see something. Okay, this is a die cut. I cut this out. I'm going to put it in my capsule. I'm going to put this one in the capsule, too, because um, we're going to that craft fair, harvest festival. There's a craft fair and everything. So, we used to go up there every year, and uh, I'll tell you more about that trip later, but um, what else do we have? This is stamped images of mine that I did. That's stamped images. That's actual pictures. This is more Christmas-related. Okay, so I'm going to close that, but I just want to show you all this I consider to be ephemera, too. So... Let's, how are we doing on time? Um, let's look through what we have, because I think, um, I do have some paper that's in my little box that I can put, um, my offcuts from my journals, from my journal. This one I'm going to put in there, because I definitely want to use it, and maybe that one. Um, I mean, it doesn't matter. I can use them from my box, too. I'm just trying to make sure I have... Okay, woo! I got a lot of stuff in here. So, let's count. One, two, three, four, 
five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty one, twenty two, twenty three, twenty four, twenty five, twenty six, twenty seven, twenty eight, twenty nine, thirty, thirty one. 32, 33, 34, 35, 36, 37, 38, 39. I'm going to set those to the side. 40. I'm not counting all these individually. 41, 42. I'm not counting that one. 40. Um, I'm just setting all this to the side for now. Um, 43, 44. Put that one back. 45. 46, 47, 48, 49, 50, 51, 52, 53, 54, 55, uh oh, 56, 57, 58, 59, 60, 61, 62, 63, 64, 65, 66, 67, 68, 69, 70, I got a little gung-ho, 71, oh dear, 72, 73, I'm not going to count those, 74, 75, I put it in here, 76, 77, 78, 79, 80, 81. Um, Might take these two things out. And then I have the paper in the bottom. So I have a lot of stuff in this. Um, I want to get these cut up. Stickers, they're just in here because I want to make sure to use them. As many of them this month as I can. Um, yeah, I've got 80 some odd things in here. Including some of the stickers, we'll say even 90. Um, all the little stuff ended up on the bottom of that pile, and I probably shouldn't have done that. <sighs> oh, look. Hold on. I'm going to add this candy corn sticker in here because it's laying on my desk. I'd set it to the side for October. I think there's another one. Yep. Um, candy corn sticker. Another one. And I've got some other stickers over here. I need to put them up. So, yeah. I, um, and I have all these little bits and bins and baskets of stuff that I need to clean out. And we may do that together someday. Um, I don't want to put too much purple in here because I need to put these in my, in my little box there. I don't want to put too many in here. Um, how about this little ribbon right here? Because um, I don't know. I don't remember why. Just because. Oh, too many purple things. Because I'm only going to use purple like with the Halloween paper. Otherwise, I don't necessarily think of purple being being an October or fall thing. Um, maybe like this color, purple is more of a burgundy purple. You know, maybe that, but this vibrant purple like this, I'll probably only use like on Halloween or leading up to it. But anyway, this is all the stuff I want to be conscious enough. I'm conscious enough. Yes, I do want to be conscious enough, but I want to be... I want them in my line of sight every day. 
because I, I want to make sure I whittle away at it. Um, even if I don't use all that paper, even if I don't use whatever, but keep in mind, I also set the parameters that I would use this stuff for tags as well. So this keeps it in my line of sight. I'm going to put this in here to do something with. I'm either going to use it or I'm going to toss it, right? So there's that. Um, oh no. Oh dear. I have, okay, those are empty baskets. Thank goodness. This was more of that stuff from my friend. And it's to, it's also to my left, but it's a little further away than I can see. So I tend not to use it necessarily, but I'll just have to keep it a little bit closer at hand. Here's that TV I've been looking for. Okay, I'm gonna put that in the, cause I've gone to use that a couple of times and um, I didn't know where it went. So now I have my answer. That's a good fall notepad. And yeah, I've got to, I've got to do away with all these little baskets. Now I was thinking this might be good background for October. It's just a Whataburger bag. But anyway, okay. Well, I appreciate you taking that little trip with me. Um, I also have, hold on, but wait. I have my October notepad, so I'm going to put that in there, too. doesn't mean I'm going to use it up. I just want it to be in my line of sight. So, sorry, I didn't mean to make you dizzy. But um, I hope that you enjoyed that. Um, I also realized that I don't have my stickers in here. So, I, I had them in my September basket, I think. Or, uh, yeah, see here, so I could pull the fall out of that, but I really don't want to separate. Yeah, I could. That would be, might be a good idea. What do you think? Good idea to pull it out. It's got all the holidays in it. Thanksgiving. I don't know. I'll make that decision later because that's a lot of pages to take out of that sticker book. So for right now, I'm going to leave them in there, but I may pull them out later. And uh, so anyway, have you given any thought to doing a capsule? Um, I'm so grateful to Lydia for inspiring me in so many different ways. And yeah, I, um, I'm really enjoying it. it. The end, towards the end of September, it got really hard. There was some stuff I haven't used yet. I still have some pages to do. Um, there's a couple of things that I will move over to this capsule like my glasses, because I didn't get them. And um, there's a couple other things I didn't use. Some of it I just don't like, and I'm going to get rid of it. So that's a other, you know, that's another good way of, you know, deciding whether you like something or not. Because if you don't like it enough to put it on your page in a month, you know, as long as it fits the season and, you know, whatever, then maybe you just need to let it go. So anyway, all right, again, I hope that you enjoyed this and I hope that um, I appreciate you being here. That's what I was going to say. And I hope to see you in the next video. Y'all have a great day. Bye.